Hello guys, um, here and uh, first of all I want to wish you a welcome to my channel uh, Sweden and the Philippines journey. Today I'm uh, going to put in a differential in this uh, electric central here. This is a standard family house and uh, they have a central like you can see here and it's pretty um, normal central for a house this size. What is a differential? Well, simply it's a safety for the human beings and the animals living in this house. It's to prevent an electric shock if you touch some current or some voltage somewhere in the house. That could happen by accident or something is wrong with your equipment. So here today we're gonna put in a differential. I have actually started the installation a little bit uh, but I will explain for you how it works. Uh, in the electric central in Sweden, you have three phases coming in here. In uh, the Philippines, I know there is only one phase coming in. And then you have a ground. That one ground is also used as a zero. But uh, first we will explain a little bit how it works. Okay. Well, here is the central. And uh, you have a lot of fuses here for different purposes and you, here you have an interrupter the current is coming in through these three uh, cables here there is the number one two and three uh, that they call them phase one, one phase two phase phase three and you can see here in this little hole here uh, they're coming out here and this they, it's also coming out the blue line here well normally it should be the green and yellow but it's coming out the blue one to the uh, this uh, is a metal uh, uh, ground and this is the metal zero they are uh, combined with this metal here and the screw here so when you don't have a differential you have to have a combination so you, they are actually the same uh, metal here um, bar metal bar I would say that call that we call it metal bar this is the ground metal bar and this is the zero uh, the normally you use a blue color on that zero uh, bar uh, and here you're using a green and yellow cable that's normal procedure there are many different ones especially the old centrals anyhow here comes into the ground from the ground you take a cable down here and you're going down to the differential. This is the differential. Uh, explain for you. This differential we will use instead of this screw here. So we are going to attach the, the, the bar, the uh, zero bar together with the ground bar. But we will lose this screw. So there is no connection right now here. But we will connect it through this uh, yellow green cable coming down to the differential. And on the bottom of the differential here, it's in an interrupter, this one, interrupter differential. So here comes out the blue cable under there. So when you turn this one up, you will automatically have a connection between those two. And that one is connected up here on the blue bar, metal bar. So they will have a connection in the future but the difference here is that this screw is permanent a connection this one will also be permanent as long as this one is on it's on and now it's off well what's the difference well the difference is that this little thing here the differential equipment will save your life once uh, you touch a face. Here are the three faces coming into the differential and this will say like uh, it's coming in here uh, and we are using uh, let's say 10 amps ampere and the differential will feel that the 10 ampere is coming in here transforming here going up to the fuses one two and three and coming out to the fuses and then out to the house. Uh, that means that if there is coming in 10 amps ampere in this differential it will feel how many ampere is going out through the zero here 
and that has to be exact uh, sorry that has to be exactly the same amount of ampere this differential will feel the difference of 30 milliampere it allows up to 30 milliampere because some machines they are leaking ampere so we couldn't go down to zero because then the machines would not work this one will break out it will go down and it will cut off all the current uh, voltage actually everybody's call, uh, talking about current but uh, the, the the law of ohms is actually that if you have voltage and then you have resistance and then it will produce a current so incoming here to the interrupter is only voltage in this case it's three phases so it's 400 voltage in here and distributed in different phases it will be 230 volt so the differential will feel if you touch well you don't touch here because you don't hear with the fingers but if you are here uh, doing uh, with a little socket or outlet then you maybe put your finger in here well then you're gonna die probably if you don't have this little machine because for a fuse to re resolve it might take one or two seconds but for the differential it take 30 milliseconds to break out it's much much it's 10 times quicker than a few than a fuse so this one will probably cut off the um, the voltage as the current that comes and produces in your body you produce a current in your body so that will break so fast so you probably uh, most uh, probably will survive uh, an, an electric shock if you have a kid that push his finger in there and and then he's standing here on the concrete floor or the tiles that will produce a current in the body because you have voltage here and your body is the resistance just like a lamp so um, this one little machine is actually a life saver uh, I know this is a long explanation but to to install a differential um, is very good in the household the, the big difference is actually that the fuse will probably or not always it will break out but the differential will certainly do that and 10 times faster than a fuse and that 10 times faster is what will save your life because you could probably uh, coop a little uh, amount of ampere in your body but not for a long time then you will be fried like a chicken so that's uh, how i'm gonna install this and continue to install this now this is just a little short video how to do this good luck call the electrician see you soon don't forget to subscribe <laughs>